welcome back to my channel. So this time we're going to talk about linear functions. Uh, if you have any questions regarding the previous lessons about relation and function, ilalagay ko sa description box ko yung mga link niya para mapanood niyo rin and magkaroon kayo ng idea tungkol sa i-discuss ko ngayon. I-define muna natin ang linear function. A linear function is just an equation. It describes a specific relationship between a dependent and independent variable. This is an example of what a linear function looks like. f of x is equal to ax plus b. Yes, you're going to read this as f of x. Okay? Now, if you are familiar with the equation of the line, you will know that this is somewhat similar to y is equal to mx plus b. The equation of the line in slope-intercept form is just an example of a linear function. It describes a specific relationship between the independent variable, which is x, and the dependent variable, which is the y. So, yung function notation na f of x ang gagamitin natin instead of y. Kasi, this only proves na ang equation na to really depends on the value of x. I have here an example, f of x is equal to 4x plus 5. So, if we have the value of x as 3, lahat ng x na nakikita natin, ipapalit natin sa value ng x. Napaka-simple lang ng gagawin natin. I-evaluate lang natin siya. So, f of 3 will become 4 times 3 plus 5. So, yung 4x magiging 4 times 3. Okay? And then, f of 3 is equal to 12 plus 5. Then, f of 3 is equal to 17. Okay? So, that is how you solve the linear function. So, another example is f of x is equal to 3x minus 9. Now, if we have the value of x as equal to 2, then we are going to substitute the value of x to this x. So, f of 2 is equal to 3 times 2 minus 9. Then, we have f of 2 is equal to 6 minus 9. And what is 6 minus 9? f of 2 is equal to negative 3. Ang function ay maraming klase, hindi lang linear function. Meron quadratic function, may cubic function, etc. But then, ang linear function ang pinakamadali. So, kitang-kita naman, di ba, kung gaano kadali. It's simply adding or subtracting integers. Ganun lang, basta substitute the value of x. So, I hope may natutunan kayo sa aking itinuro ngayon na napakadali. Okay? Wala nang magsasabi na ang hirap ng ma. Madali lang, di ba? Okay? So, see you on my next video. Abangan!